A prayer saves more than three. First of all, we must receive a prayer because of our past. The problem of our past is we may not know when we were affected, but we must receive our, a prayer because of our past. In most times, we seek a prayer because of our present situation. It's also a need. When you don't feel all right, you must receive a prayer. God must use a man of God to deliver you. But many people don't know that you must also receive a prayer because of your future. Why so? Because in most times there are things that are waiting for us in the future that if you don't receive a hand or a touch, they will gain access to your life. For example, when you are praying and you say, God bless my trip, that's a prayer for the future. You are saying, as I go, let it be safe. But most people, they only seek deliverance, healing, because of the current situation. But the truth is, it's more than one. Your past may be terrible. Your current situation may need a solution. But hiddenly, without your knowledge, your future may be under attack. So a wise person, a wise person always looks for the prayer, searches for the prayer, hands for the prayer, that even your future may be safe. Get hold of this, treasure it, and protect your tomorrow. May you lift your hands. May your future be protected. May your future be protected. May your future be protected. May your tomorrow be safe. May your tomorrow be safe. Be covered and be protected. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen.